Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Monica. Today we're doing a little bit of a different video. It is a big declutter. So this is the first time I've actually gone through and decluttered my entire closet in one shot. I've always been a fan of decluttering. I'm, I consider myself a very neat person, but when it comes to my closet and all of my clothes, I tend to be a bit of a hoarder and it's not that great and I tend to get a lot of like hand-me-downs and pieces that I know won't really work for me but because of either the way they were given to me or you know other circumstances I just hang on to them knowing that I'm not you know using them at all so I had like suitcases full of clothes that I never touched in years and I had a closet that I could barely even like get into or move around so this video was a long time coming and it is going to be a little bit more casual but I do enjoy watching videos like this. I love putting them on in the background especially when like the organization part is sped up and put to nice music. So I had a whole lot of fun doing this. I had a lot of fun decluttering and putting this video together so I hope you'll like it. That's, these are the videos that I really find myself like liking. Like when the people just like sit down and just like talk right to the camera and you know get down and dirty with the organization down and dirty let's go ahead and jump right in alrighty so to start my closet declutter this is going to take quite a while I don't actually have room to lay out all of my clothes at one time so this is about uh this is half of what I have hanging up on that rack so out of all of my clothing this is probably about one fourth of it so I think I'm going to chunk it up and do it like that. I'm going to do each half of my clothing rack first. And then I'm going to go into my drawers, pull everything out, do all that next. And then last, I'm going to do the clothes that I have in storage. This is what I keep in my suitcases. Alright, so it's a bit of a mess, but we've made it through all of the hanging clothes, and I've done the first two drawers in my dresser because those are like, you know, socks, underwear, headbands, negligible things. Let's take a look at what the closet looks like. The lighting in here is terrible, so excuse me. But this is the side where I keep anything that I would consider work appropriate. Anything nice, I have my blouses. I organize it by, my favorite sweater is right over here. Then I have all of my dresses. Nice dresses, and then it goes from dresses to cardigans. I basically live in dresses and cardigans at work, and cardigans any other time of the year. <laughs> and then it goes into blouses. I have all my nice blouses. And then these last two, like, hanging things, I have all my leggings on here, which I definitely decluttered a decent amount, and I have a few in the laundry right now. And then pants. I'm actually really happy with how the pants are right now. 
I have basically one of each color and I'm very happy. I have one pair of normal jeans, one pair of black jeans, one pair of like burgundy jeans, one pair of white jeans, you know, you're set. And then let me see what would be the best way to do this. So if you rotate my shelf around, this is kind of like my casual, casual, can I speak today? This is my more casual side of the closet. I have a couple of jackets that aren't really big enough to put downstairs. I have my, um, like this is kind of like a two-way. You could wear it as a scarf. You could wear it as a, like a cardigan kind of thing. I have sweaters. I have all of my casual tops. I basically live in gray and stripes and black. <laughs> and then I have all of my Giants gear down here. Still a Giants fan. It will be until the day that I die. And then I have like my really nice, I have one really nice dress that I will keep. And I have my yukatas that I got in Japan, so those are also not going anywhere. Um, but I'm actually really happy with how this is. I can actually see like my own style and my own kind of uniform like coming through now. And I have so much more room. Like before I was like struggling to get hangers to fit on here. And even on like the work side. Zoom. And even on the work side, I have room for hopefully not growth. I don't think I need too many more items right now, but room to actually, like, do that <laughs> and actually look at the clothes that I have right now. So that's where we are right now. I've already decluttered my bags. I have them all hanging right there next to my shoes. I've also already decluttered my shoes. These are all of them right there. I'm really happy with my shoe collection now. It's a good mixture of, you know shoes I would wear in the summer. I have my flats, I have my um, I have my wedges, I have my boots over here in the corner. And you know, overall, I think this is a good collection. I think if it was any bigger than this, it would be out of control, but I have everything, it's on display, I can see everything, and I like it. Do, 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 do. So this is the pile so far. So this is the pile so far. I do have to go through it because there are some things in here that are either too old or too damaged to get donated. But everything else is going to be given to my local Goodwill. So the next step, I have two steps left. The next step is to go through all of my drawers right here. And then I'm going to pull up all of my suitcases, which I keep all of like my off-season or storage clothes in. And then we'll go through those as well.
So we have finally reached the end. The end total, I have one, two of the giant clear garbage bags. Actually, I think they're for recyclables, but I ran out of those bags, so the rest are in three garbage bags. Now, four of these bags are going to be donated to my local Goodwill. The one bag, the one all the way right there, is full of stuff that is either too damaged, too old, or just actually like ripped to shreds that I can't donate. So all of these will be put to good use. They will be given to better homes. Overall, I feel there is just a huge weight lifted. I've never been able to go through and do a full closet declutter like this. I've always done mini declutters in like little chunks and you never really get through everything that way. So now when I look at my closet, I see my style. I see pieces that I know I love that I actually wear and I'm happy. <laughs> So thank you so much for going on this journey with me. I hope if you like this video, you'll go ahead and give it a thumbs up. I'm not sure I'll be doing any more big declutters like this in the future, but go ahead and hit that subscribe button just in case. And if you'd like, you can go ahead and check out some of my regular content. Mainly I focus on like makeup and makeup declutters, but sometimes I'll go and I'll do videos like this. So thank you so much for spending today with me and I hope you'll have a great day. Bye.